I think there's a big misnomer about oncology. Obviously, there's a lot of fear, um, you know, a lot of sadness when people hear about a cancer diagnosis. But in all honesty, we have a lot of victories. I've been touched by my patients on a daily basis. We have good outcomes. We do have good stories. Um, it's not always sadness. Yeah, in the past 15, 20 years, it's been an amazing evolution. We're learning more and more about targeted therapy, not just giving high-dose chemotherapy that just kills all active cells. It's becoming more uh, tolerable. Um, our success rates are definitely improving. You know, as far as mortality, we're getting better as far as early detection. Um, so it really is a very interesting career. And it seems like every time we make a new breakthrough, it opens another door and there's more doors that continue to be open. So I think we're just at the tip of the iceberg when it comes to cancer treatment. But thankfully, it's moving in the right direction. We're learning that all, all cancers are created equally. Even all breast cancers, they can have a very diverse um, activity level. Um, so even things that we did when I started practice as far as you know how many women were receiving chemotherapy, we've significantly and drastically cut that down just by um, more sensitive testing, more diagnostic testing. Uh, and again, we're now able to test particular tumors and see if they have specific markers. So even in the world of lung cancer, uh, one patient may need to use chemotherapy, another patient may be able to use pills. Um, and it's really, really opening, like I said, the doors to cancer treatment. I grew up in Western Pennsylvania. I think there's just a hard work ethic, um, a sense of community, and I really see that in Butler. Um, you know, I, I see where people are taking care of their patients as if they're their own family member. Um, kind of putting the patient before their own personal needs. And uh, even though we're talking about a community hospital as opposed to, you know, a huge conglomerate health system, uh, they're always looking to make advances. They are very open to, you know, researching the latest technology, you know, providing whatever they can to the community that will best serve them.